Hello. Today I will be showing you how to use a diff tag, diff tag, and external CSS. So let's dive into it. So the first thing we want to do is to open our developer console. If you watch my last video, my previous video about CS, uh, CSLs, we've talked about inline, we've talked about internal. So today we are talking about external and uh, I just add diff tag to it. So I want to talk about diff tag first. So the diff tag, what the diff tag does in in Visual Force page is it defines a division same thing it does in html that's what the tag does in the visual force page as well so we had this tag so we can copy this we can copy this our link output link Paste it inside the diff tag. So with this diff tag, we can create a class that we'll be using in this style. Class. Name it my div. So, can I go to the CSS style? So, I'm going to be use to use a custom. Uh, to use a custom element in this style, we have to use the dots dot symbol and uh, we use my div Like to make it so we can go to our CSS to to add in any CSS. So let's add in to the virtually school. So we want to use the um, Want to use margin? I want to place the. You want to place the word the. The output link. I want to paste it in the middle of the page, so we can use the margin. So I would love to use this one. I want to use this one. So come here. I paste it here. I can change this to iPhone drops and save it. So I'll go to preview. So I can see this way I place the the scratch our channel and this is exactly what the diff tag does. It helps you to to create a section like divide the 
whatever you want to use it to do. So you can use it for pretty much anything you want. You want your page to look nice. So let's move on to the external CSS. For the external CSS, we are going to be using this static resource. And we are going to copy this particular style. We to copy it. Before we are going to comment it here. So I'm going to save it. I'm going to go inside my hog. Open static resource. So you open your static resource. You must have saved the CSS file, CSS code. You must have saved it as a CSS file in your system, in a notepad. So I'm going to be using this so that you can import it here. I've already saved my as style the CSS. This public and, uh, then I copy this name go into my developer console best I shoot value and I use a resource charge dot name close it and I save saving it takes few seconds sometimes to save saved so click on preview I go to my page Look on this, and here you have our subscribe to our channel as an external CSS. So that's all for the if tag and external CSS. If you want to learn more about this, you can drop it in the comment section. And if you have any questions or suggestions, you can also drop it in the comment section. Thank you. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel.